Hey everyone, it's April and welcome back to my channel. Today I am sharing with you a crazy haul of good deals that I picked up from Walmart when I was there grocery shopping and I thought I would hop on and share this in case you guys are also making a grocery run and you want to kind of just look in the aisle right by the seasonal stuff and get some goodies for yourself. If you're new here, I'd love for you to subscribe and without further ado, let's get on into the haul. So let me first start off by saying that all of the Easter decor was all 90% off and the candy was 75. So I got all of these packs of eggs. I got three different kinds. These are like a speckled, you know, kind of bright colored. And then these ones are more neon, even more bright. And they have white speckles. And then these eggs have kind of cute little like Easter zigzag polka dots, different patterns. And these were only 19 cents a pack. Each of the packs have six eggs in them. And I got all of these eggs for under $2. And they originally were $2 a piece. These kind of eggs are good to fill just Easter baskets up with for decor or to have egg hunts with your kids. Um, so a great steal if you want to pick some of these up for next year. Next, I found these jumbo eggs that say they are dyeable, which I guess that means you could paint and you could do whatever you want to them. I kind of like them just as is. I'm going to use them on my front porch in a basket and just a couple spots that I could have used some eggs this year. And these were $4 originally and I got them for 39 cents a piece. Next, I found these adorable Easter baskets. The larger one was $6, so I got it for $0.60, cents, and the smaller one was $5, so I got that one for $0.50, cents, so like a $0.10 cent difference. And they're really strong and really nice baskets, and I thought these would also be cute for decorating next year. I could just put some grass and some eggs in them, and if not, I could give them as gifts for that price. Super cute. Next, I picked up two of these metal pails, one in the turquoise color and one in the purple. And they have a cute little like wooden handle on them. And these were $3 originally, so they were $0.29 cents a piece. And I picked up a turquoise one last week when they were 75% off and I put some dog treats in it. And they would just be really cute for storage and, you know, just when you need an extra little caddy around the house. So I picked up two more of these. Next, I found these two tobacco baskets. They're like little mini ones that you could either hang on the wall, put on a shelf, anything like that. And I'm not really crazy about the blue color, but for, I believe these came down to 30 cents a piece as well. And I figured I could paint them, you know, chalk paint them, spray paint them, something like that. And for 30 cents, you cannot beat it because they have them right now in other colors for, I believe, full price in their spring line. Next, I picked up these cute little gold bunnies on blocks. And again, I don't really decorate with a lot of gold, so I might paint them or do something with these for next year. And that little egg holder basket, that was nine cents. And the two little bunnies were 39 cents a piece, I believe. And for those prices, I just thought these would be really cute for tiered trays for next year. Just might give them a little makeover. Moving on, I got this rolling pin that has like the little Easter die cuts on that you can roll this onto dough. Will I do that? I don't know, but it's the color of my kitchen. So I thought even to use as decor for Easter, that would be super cute. And that was 29 cents. And then this little kind of pedestal dish, it says Happy Easter. Since it was the color of my kitchen also, I thought it'd be cute to just put some candy in or if I had a little Easter get together with family next year, I could also put some other type of sweets in it. And that was 49 cents. Moving on to a whole bunch of little random things here. I got these little mini baking cups. They were nine cents. I thought they were really cute with the little bunny and the jelly beans. I got these clear treat bags with the eggs and they come with like little tie strings on the back. You get 20 of them and they were 19 cents. 
I found this cute Easter gift bag. I saw other crafters haul it this year and then put it in a frame. I might just use it as a gift bag, but either way, it was 19 cents. And then I picked up a pack of these white craft eggs. I bought these in the past and, you know, done a lot of things with them, put glued moss on them, wrapped twine on them, and I got the whole pack for only 19 cents. They will come in handy next year for some DIY projects, I'm sure. Now, kind of a little off of the decor topic, but I did get some candy. So I just wanted to show you guys, I got some Reese's eggs, some Hershey's kisses and hugs. And then I also got a bag that has like a variety, 70 pieces of Snickers, Twix, Milky Ways, and Musketeers. And all these are 75% off. So they were either 75 cents or $1.50. So can't beat that. Definitely good to stock up on some candy for these many, many, days at home <laughs> and then lastly I picked up some wooden art pieces I hauled um, a bunny picture like this a few weeks ago that was different coloring and I paid like I think it was ten dollars for it well I got this for 99 cents guys crazy and it might give it a little bit of a makeover because it's not my colors but overall super cute I love the picture that I picked up so it'll be nice to have a little matching set and then this bunny picture I normally probably wouldn't pick this up but I got four of them because they came down to 80 cents like I just couldn't believe it they were eight dollars originally and I like the picture actually and I really love the frame so I might use one of them for my Easter decor and then the others I'll either give them as gifts or as I've showed you guys in other videos how I will make over something like this I will paint it mod podge some paper on it and create my own pictures for different holidays so if you guys see things like this definitely pick them up they came in great handy for diy projects and save you a ton of money oh and one more thing i thought i was done but i also found this cute little cottontail rabbit farm bucket and i just think it's cute it looks really farmhouse and be cute to just stick some greenery or some flowers in and i got this for 29 cents it was three dollars originally super cute probably one of my favorite things that i found in this haul and that is it guys i hope you enjoyed this haul and I'm not, you know, saying that you should run to Walmart, especially if you're staying in and trying to stay safe. But I thought I would hop on and show you this just in case you happen to be out grocery shopping and you want to get some good deals. So until the next one, I'll see you then. Bye.